Hi, I'm Sheila Moylan and uh, I'm one of the tutors at the Irish Cultural Centre in Hammersmith and uh, we really miss all of you while we're in lockdown and we look forward to seeing you soon and we want to thank you for supporting uh, the Irish Centre with all our digital programmes and classes and all the online events. So to keep you going till we actually open, uh, I think we're all going to do some tunes for you. So I'd like to start with uh, a Moore's Melody, and this is a song my granddad used to sing, and it's called Oft in the Stilly Night. So I hope you like it. slumber's chain has bound me fond memory brings a light of other days around me the smiles and tears of boyhood's years those words of love then spoken the eyes that shone now dimmed and gone, those cheerful hearts now broken, thus in the stilly night, their slumber's chain have bound me, sad memory brings When I remember all those friends so linked together, I have seen around me fall like leaves in wintry weather. I feel like one who treads a lonesome banquet. And gardens dead, and all but me departed. The in the stilly night. So I have some other songs for you. The next one I would like to do is one uh, which is partly by the poet William Blake, um, who is a favourite poet of mine, an English poet, and I found out that his uh, poems, the Songs of Innocence and Experience, were originally songs. And he used to sing them, and apparently he was a great singer, but they are lost. So uh, I took it upon myself to write some music to his uh, songs, original songs. So this is one called London, and uh, it's a favourite of mine, uh, one of my favourite poems of all time. So I was very happy to write some music to it. So I need to change key here, so...
also London, words by Blake, uh, music by myself. you all know, uh, you should do, uh, made very popular by Don McLean, uh, but is a wonderful song about emigrating to London and as the last song is quite a sad one about London. This one has a lot of humour in it, uh, which I really like. So uh, this is Mountains of Morn. <laughs> Oh, Mary, this London's a wonderful sight Where there's people out working by day and by night They don't sell potatoes, nor barley, nor wheat But there's gangs of them digging for gold in the street At least when I asked them, that's what I was told. So I just tried my hand at this digging for gold. But for all that I found there, I might as well be where the mountains of moon sweep down to the sea. I believe. you expressed to know how the young ladies of London are dressed. Well, would you believe me when asked to a ball? They don't wear no tops to their dresses at all. Oh, I've seen them myself and you cannot Tell if they were bound for a ball or a bath. Don't 
be starting them fashions now Mary Mochree where the mountains of morn sweep down to the sea you remember young Peter all Lachlan of course he's over here and he's head of the force I saw him Crossing the strand, and he stopped the whole street with a wave of his hand. And while we were talking of days that are gone, the whole population of London looked on. But for all the I've seen England's king from the top of the bus. We don't know him, but he means to know us. And though by the Saxon we once were oppressed, I cheered, God forgive me, I cheered with the rest. And now that he When we've got all we want, sure we're quiet as can be. Where the mountains of moon sweep down to the sea. There's beautiful girls here, oh never do you mind. Beautiful shapes nature never of roses and green but O'Loughlin remarked with regard to the same that if from those roses we ventured to sip the colour So I'll wait for the wild rose who's waiting for me where the mountains of morn sweep down to the sea wall very soon. Thank you.